Hello and welcome to another video from inzara.com. This time we are going to do a demo of the new combinations generator Excel template which is designed for multiple lists. So this can support up to 10 different lists of values and it can help you generate the combinations uh, automatically and instantly in Excel. This template is part of the combinations generator toolkit bundle which you can get from inzara.com. You'll find the link to download it from the video description below. So this is the Excel template. I have it open. I'm going to just make sure that first, if you see a security warning message at the top, please hit enable content. And I just want to clarify here that this template does not have any connections to any online systems. It is just of an Excel file that you'll be downloading and using it in your own computer. All the data will be within your own computer. There is no connection to anything else. However, there are queries used within the file itself and Excel considers that as an external data connection. But if you hit enable content, it should allow you to now, you know, this I'm going to hit yes. Do you want to make this a trusted document? Yes. And once again, I want to clarify that there's no macro or anything like that. There are just queries within Excel. Now let me walk you through the steps how you can use this template to generate the combinations. First step is to make sure that we can enter the different lists and the values in each list. So I have entered here um, six different lists. So you can see that the car manufacturer name, the type of car, how many doors, you know, is it an electric or a hybrid? And then is it a new car or a used car? Am I, do I want to buy or lease? So these are the different values, let's say. And if I want to generate combinations from a value from each of the lists here, so that's what I want to generate and that's what this template is designed to do. So I can pick Audi and maybe I pick SUV, four door, electric, used for buying, for example. So that's one combination. And so the template will calculate how many such combinations are possible. So it lists, it displays it here as 216 combinations. So the values will lead to 216 combinations. Now there are, as I said, the maximum is 10 lists that are supported and within each list you can have up to 20 items. And then the second step is where you can define a delimiter. Delimiter is nothing but, you know, when the combinations are displayed, what do you want to display between the values here? So I have chosen, you know, a hyphen. If I want to use plus, I can just do that. And now that is my delimiter. So it's very easy to change whatever your delimiter is. You can do that. If you don't want a delimiter, just, just hit the delete key here so that it, there's nothing delimiting between the values here. And then the third important step is to refresh the calculations. So anytime we make a change to the input values here, we need to refresh the calculation. So let me just show you a demo here. So if I want to put Ford as a new value, and now you can see that I have four car manufacturers, and you see that the number here became 288, because now I expect a lot more combinations, right? And you see the message here at the top, which says press the refresh all in the data ribbon and wait for processing. And so this means, uh, again, a reminder that we have modified the input and we need to go to the data ribbon, hit refresh all, and then now you'll see at the bottom left that there is a message saying running background query, oh, it's finished. It now gives you 288 combinations and you can instantly see all the values here. And let me just scroll to the right and it goes all the way to 288. So now you have created these combinations immediately and you can do the same way by adding more values or adding up to 10 different lists. The more values that you enter and more combinations are required to be displayed, please keep in mind that it might take a little bit um, longer to refresh. And then in that case, you may have even more than 2000 um, combinations. So if you have more than 2000 combinations, you have to go down to the bottom of this table. And I have a little message here which tells you how you can extend it. Um, in order to extend it, we have to unprotect the sheet. So I go here, unprotect, and I put my password in Zara. Okay. And then now I can extend it for more than 2000 combinations. 
So if your need is more than 2000 combinations, you have to come in and then expand this table. But now let me go back to the top and then if, um, let, let's try to come up with a scenario where we have more than 2000 values. So I'm going to go ahead and paste some values here. If you are to paste any data from another sheet, uh, the recommendation is right click, paste as values. That makes sure that only the values, only the values are pasted and not the formatting or the formula. So that's very important. So maybe let's try to increase a little bit more and then see if we can reach um, 2000 combinations. So what else can we do? Um, let me just say maybe five door and then now we reach um, up to that. Let's call it sports car. And so now we have 2448 combinations for these values. And we have a message that shows up that if you want to extend beyond that, then I go here, as I mentioned, you can extend it beyond that. Now, before we do that, anything more on that, we do know that the data is not displayed here in the combinations, and that's because we have modified the input. The message says, press refresh all. So I'm gonna go ahead to data, refresh all, and it is going to go and refresh. While, while it's getting loaded, what I did was I hit the queries and connections option here, and you see that the queries and connections were showing how many records are being loaded. So if you were to kind of wait for this to load, this will tell you how many have been completed and if 2448 2, matches this. That means it's fully loaded and you can see the values. And I'm gonna to go to the bottom of the table and then you see that it reached 2010. So we have more combinations we need to get. So all I have to do is to just keep expanding until I reach 2000. 448 so let's see how quickly I can go there and I have reached 24 almost there I think I reached there there we go 2448 I have all the combinations all I have to do is to now control shift up arrow and then I can copy control C and then I can go to another sheet or another file and then right click paste as values and that'll paste these values. So this is how easy, simple, and effective this template can be to address your need to create combinations from up to 10 different lists, 200 items in each list. And again, keep in mind that the more values you put in, the more combinations it is, please give it a little bit of time for Excel to process through all those combinations and display it for you. It's very simple to use. If your needs are beyond the you know what the template provides but if you need them to be developed please reach out to us and we can help you with a customized project uh, that will help meet your needs if you have any questions please post them in the comment section below thank you very much for watching and i'll look forward to seeing you in the next video thank you